wonder what Professor Fig has found in this locket. Hmm. Very curious. Oh, um... Good evening, gents. Revelio. Ah, what's this? Ravenclaw door knocker. To gain entrance to the Ravenclaw common room, one must solve a rather esoteric riddle using logic and reasoning post posed by the eagle door knocker. Well, we must have solved it because we got in. Perfect. The, the urge to twiddle all those globes is rather hard to ignore. Is it not? Revelia. Anything else? Hmm. Oh, a box. Well, it would be rude not to. Gold-rimmed circular spectacles. Hmm. Maybe spectacles would be a good look. Is there here? No. Just a statue. Just a statue. Okay. Oh, hello. Okay. Revelio. Wow. Quite the view from this bridge. Oh, never mind. Ah. Hmm. Not too sure on that one. There we go. Hmm. Never mind. The armour looked oddly suspicious. Oh! What are these strange looking plants? Well, hmm. never mind. We must find Professor Fig and find out exactly what is happening. Revelio. Hmm. Quite the impressive, Rebellion. impressive classroom, Professor. My goodness. Ah, what's this? Butterflies. Hmm. What's this? Professor Fig. As if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the Ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can believe. Professor Weasley insists that they will need an escort and a mentor to help them acclimatise before term begins. I have assigned the task to you. Please see Professor Weasley for details. Professor Phineas Nigellus Black, Headmaster. Well, that is just wonderful. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Then... Okay. Professor. Hmm. Is there anything else in here? Oh. oh. <gasps> Oops. Can I maybe? They prepared themselves. What are these strange little creatures? I keep seeing them everywhere. Rebellion. Weird. Very odd looking. Oh dear. Um. Prepare. Oh. All right. Well, let's wait. Professor Fig, hello. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. 
Ranrock was in Hogsmeade mm -hmm. with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me, and he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. <sighs> yeah, ab about the goblins at Gringotts? Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. Oh. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Well, <sighs> Ranrock and Rookwood want the locket, they do. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. Ah. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. <gasps> Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. No. It leads to the library. The restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecket know to expect you. Well, all right. That's fair. That's very fair. What? Professor Hecket, okay. Well, thank you, sir, for your okay. time. I don't think there's anything else in here. What's this? Butterflies in jars. Some kind of bizarre skeleton? No? Well, never mind. <sighs> All very strange indeed. All very strange. What's this? Something? No. So. You. What? Revelio. Hmm. Yes. We need to hone our defensive skills. What? What? Get away from me. Oh dear. I believe that's the gentleman being chased by his his wife, maybe? Former wife? I don't know. Not too sure on that one. Not too sure. Another globe to spin, thank you. All right. Might some kind soul help me? I could be that kind soul, Zenobia Noak. Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? No. Zenobia Noak, the girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Um. Why does everyone hate you? Everyone hates you? Why? Yeah. Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. Oh. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Sounds lovely. Um, yeah, interesting. Gobstones. Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. Oh dear. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. 
Um, it does sound as if they overreacted a bit. I mean, it is a game. Oh, rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year, to help me. Okay, kid, I get it. Um, any ideas on how to reach them? I assume using maybe Leviosa or something? Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Or Accio. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. Hmm. I mean, you don't have any friends. Surely you have some friends. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Oh dear. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. Hmm. Well, Natty's nice. Well, I can't make any promises that I'll get them, but I'll try. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Well, all right. I can I can find gobstones, I think. Hmm. Rebellion. Never forget what that awful book tells you. Oh well. Oh, that's class, that is. Hmm. So her gobstones are out here. What? I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobblestones. Oh, look at those owls. My goodness. How beautiful. Ah, I spy with my little eye something that looks like a gobstone. Yeah. Okay, no, not, not, not the owl. Hmm. How would one get this, do you suppose? Maybe... Let me answer. Oh, there that's we one go. Of cobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. No, it does seem a little bit ridiculous, doesn't it? But well, I suppose it's you know, it is but a thing that we must resolve for the poor girl. Revenia. Oh, okay. No. Oh, missed. Ah! Another one. Oh, missed. There we are. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Alright. What's this? Oh! Oh, how bizarre. I don't think I like that. So there's one up here. I'm supposed to be going and learning some more defensive magic and yet here I am hunting bloody gobstones of all things that's showing some over here in high places up there oh my goodness that is high wow um excuse me page thank you I must collect those. I'd better Very keep useful. an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobblestones. Hmm. Ah. Is it What? Up there? Good lord. I cannot fathom this. Why Why anybody would Revenge. want to um hide someone's treasured possessions. It doesn't doesn't make sense. A little niffler there. Good lord, this ladder is long. Oh, quite the quite the tapestry though. Um, oh, what is this place? Blood red fedora. Hmm, I can hear something. Rebellion. Oh, sorry. Hmm. Another one of those strange little creatures, good lord. What's this? Mudiwa Onai. 
Under Professor Black's direction, it is my honour as Deputy Headmistress to offer you the position of Divination Professor at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are thrilled at the prospect of having you join our distinguished faculty. Please inform us of your intentions as soon as possible. I eagerly await your response. Warmest regards, Professor Matilda Weasley. Ah, it's Natty's mum. Okay. Hmm. But there, there is supposed to be a gobstone up here somewhere, I fear, but... I'm not, not quite seeing it here. Rebellion. Hmm. Well. Ah. Is it on the on the wall somewhere here? Can we? Ah. You'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobblestones. Oh. Ah. Brilliant. Another one found. And we sort of met Natty's mother, kind of. Although I don't think she was massively impressed with us just coming in and messing about with her um, things. Up there, my goodness. Quite high, quite a high spot. Okay, well, we'll wander on up, see if we can get it. <gasps> the shields, very, very interesting. Sure about these mirrors either, they're a little bit of a strange thing. Must be there for a reason. House elves. Rebellion. Hmm. Any more pages? No. These are a curiosity. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I'd better keep an eye on high places ah. around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Another gobstone, marvelous. Okay, so there's another one up. Oh, ah, one of these. <gasps> another page. Can we? Can we collect? Yes. Oh my. Well, this is quite the um, quite the staircase, is it not? Revelio. So, if we want to go up, we go up here. Okay. My goodness, what a what a what a climb! Wow. Oh, okay. Hmm. Ah, another one of these puzzle doors. Hmm. Still not quite sure about these. Hmm. We'll have a look into those after. Oh, the Grand Staircase Tower. Handy resource indeed. Rebellion. Your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Well, can we go up again from here? Oh yes. Hmm. Oh, it's up on the... T well... Is there anything up here? Hmm. No. How strange. Well, we can go up a little bit further this way, which is fine. Rebellion. Any more pages? No. Hmm. I am very curious about those doors. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobblestones. Look at all this. Very, um... Very... What on earth? 
Oh. Trophy room. Is there a something? There is. I thought there would be. Troll armor. This unusual suit of armor was crafted for a troll. That it has survived at all is astonishing, since trolls do not ordinarily wear armor and would understandably be prone to smashing it in confusion or anger. Well, they clearly did not. Well, my goodness. What have we in here? Ah, what's this? What is it? Hogwarts Herbology Award. In recognition of exemplary skill in the field of herbology, Hogwarts bestows this special award upon seventh year Hufflepuff Mirabel Garlic. From mandrakes to mistletoe and booba tubers to bouncing bulbs, her work with Flora has exceeded all expectations. Well, Bavelia. very good. Hey. So, the trophy room. My, 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 my. Aha! A page. What's this? Goblet of Fire Casket. The Goblet of Fire rests within this ancient jewel-encrusted chest. The Goblet has served as a means of selecting champions for the Triwizard Tournament since the contest's establishment in the late 13th century. Ma! Well, who knew? Rebellion. We're learning so much. An awful lot, but what on earth? Oh, badger. Hmm. Certainly an interesting... Ah, an interesting room. Can we yeah. have that, please? Thank you. Yes. Ooh. Celtic brushstroke scarf. I'd ah. better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobblestones. Is there one here? Potentially. Potentially. My, my, my. Well. Revenia. Quite the room. Quite the room indeed. Is there anything else here? Any other pages of note? Is that... Ah, I thought so. Centaur armor. This unique set of armor was created as a misguided peace offering to a centaur leader. The gift was spurned and the messenger shot through the leg with an arrow. The armor itself, battered with hoof marks, was later recovered and refurbished. Yes, I don't think they would have taken too kindly to that. I believe centaurs are not, are not particularly... Um, Enamoured, should we say, with, with, with humans and their nonsense. Aha, another page. House Elf Armour. This set of armour for a house elf room is rumoured to have been made by a cruel wizard who wanted his elf to protect him in battle. Happily, the wizard was too dense to realise that armour could, in fact, be considered clothing. The moment the elf donned it, he disapparated right out of it, never to be seen again. And fair play to him. It is technically clothing, I suppose. In a way. Hmm. Aha! I see it! Can I get it, though? Yes, I can! Marvellous! One more to find. Oh, no. This way? Aha! There's the last one. That's the last Marvelous. one. Marvellous. I should go and see her. Yes, maybe we should uh, go and return to her and um, pass them on. There you are, Zenobia. I hope you've had more luck than I did tracking down my gobstones. I have. I have. Hello, Zenobia. I've found all of your gobstones. Really? I didn't think it was possible. However did you do it? Common sense and basic magic. Well, <clears throat> may I have my gobstones back? Yes, of course. Take them. Of course. They are yours after all. Oh, how wonderful. I shall dedicate all of my future victories to you. Speaking of which, 
Now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. Hmm. Um. I don't really know whether that's a good idea. Maybe that's, yeah. That's a horrible idea. No one wants to get that awful stench all over them again. Why not? I mean, I could have said Gobstones that nicer. are splendid fun. And now everyone knows the rules. Very well. Off I go. Wish me luck. Yeah. Good luck, kid. <sighs> oh, dear. Not good. Not good. All right. Well, I suppose we should go and see Professor Hecate. And learn something new. Professor Hecate, hello! Oh, I don't like those ah, eyes. I believe we have some matters to discuss. That we do. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, Ooh. and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds versatile. Yeah. Right. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. Two rounds of cross ones and a round of spell... Complete a round of spell combination practice with Luke and Brattleby. Oh my goodness, okay. Dragon's Tail. Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. No, I think um, they're sadly deluded, unfortunately. Um, well, all right. Let's see what... The future holds here. Ah, I spy a page. Lachlan, Lachlan the Lanky. This statue depicts the wizard Lachlan the Lanky, a tall, slender wizard who appears quite proud of himself. For precisely, for what precisely, no one knows. Well, that's fine. What's this? <laughs> Well, I oh. Revelio. Map of Argyleshire. This map depicts Argyleshire, a region in Scotland which contains the Hebrides, native home of the Hebridean black dragon. Wonderful. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Hmm. What? Oh. Ah. Oh, lovely music. Um, sorry, I can't stay. That looks oddly, oddly Rebellion. openable, but it is not, unfortunately. Hmm. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just over there. Oh, well, all right. I'll just, um, you know, work my magic here. Another page. Haha. -ha. Well. All right. Small child. Revelio. Aha, I see an item. I can open. Wigan Weld. Hmm. Well, all right. Hello. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. Oh. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Oh, good. Um, that's nice to hear. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does crossed ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. I see. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? 
Yeah. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Oh. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? I'm ready. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! We'll make you regret signing up. Oh, so rude. Oh. Her dealt with. All right. Aha! We did it. Perhaps Good lord. I'll sign up for a round. Oh, my goodness! That that was a little difficult, but we did it. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second jewel is ready when you are. And Marvelous. as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Hmm. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me, and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Well, thank you. My goodness, that... Hope that, to see you back here again. That was rather difficult. Ah. First round of Crossed Ones, so we need to complete two rounds. And complete a round of spell combination practice with Lucas. Okay. Well, Lucas. Glad you're back. Um, may I use the training dummy? Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? I am. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. All right. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. All right. So, Akio. Okay. Akio. Nicely done. Levioso. Levioso. Right. Oh, oh, let me open. Okay. Oh no. Screwed up. Never mind. So. Let me open. You'll oh. get it. That was something. Let me open. Ah, there we go. Excellent four. I'd say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Hmm. Yes, indeed. Hmm. What's in here? Oh. Revelio. Well, maybe one more round. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Yes. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Um, let's duel with Sebastian again. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Oh. Cocky, what? Apologies in advance. 
Really? The adept round. All right. Blast it. Oh, there goes my way. Let me on you that round. Care to go again? Yes, let's try I'll it. I'll give it another go. Glad to hear it. Hmm. All right. No, I think we'll have a little, a little break. I think I'd better rest for a bit. Yes. Very well. We'll be waiting when you're ready. Thank you. Yes, that um, hmm, wasn't the best spell work, was it? Oh, dear. Well, never mind. I suppose I should probably get myself some Wigan Weld potions as well. That might be a good plan. Revenia. Aha, another page, as I suspected. The Well of Four Beasts. Some students believe that a wish made over the Well of Four Beasts, whether near the Thestral, Griffin, Chimera or Hippogriff, will come true for one who has gained the trust of any of the four. Interesting. Very interest interesting. Interesting. Oh, it's an owl. I did wonder. Hmm. Well, maybe I should um, wander over to Hogsmeade and get myself some um, so, some Wigan World potion. Ah, I bet we need Incendio to burn those leaves away. How very, very irritating. Well. These look interesting symbols on the floor. Hmm. Yes, a bit of Wigan Weld potion will probably go down very well, I think. Fix myself up before attempting this again. <laughs> <laughs> 